In this video, I'm going to be going over my pack predictions for this week's content drop in NBA 2K23. My team, I like to do these guesses every single Thursday before the new leak graphic comes out on Twitter at 4 p.m. Eastern time. If you guys don't know, my team posts a graphic on Twitter at 4 p.m. Eastern, most likely around 4, sometimes a little bit later, sometimes like 4.30 or 5, and they'll show us what cards we're going to be getting for tomorrow, like the graphic. We don't get to see the stats, the badges, the animations, but just what like 15 cards, 16 cards do we get from the new promo set so i like to do these guessing games on thursday to guess what cards i do think will be coming out on friday and you guys can also let me know what three invincibles you guys think we'll get what dark matters you guys think we'll get what galaxy opals you guys can make your guesses down below and then see at 4 p.m eastern time if you guys were right or wrong so let me know in the comment section down below your guys' predictions and guesses but starting it off with the invincibles that's how i like to start it off with i think these are probably the three easiest cards to predict now they're not really easy to to predict but i'm just saying that you probably have the most likely chance of predicting an invincible because there's only so many headlining names that will get an invincible card so I'm assuming this is going to be a really big content drop because if you guys don't know, my team is our 2K23, I should say, is becoming free on PlayStation on June number six. And the game is super cheap pretty much everywhere. We're going into the end game. So I predict that, and you guys have seen with the all time spotlights coming out today, you guys will know that my team's really ramping up the content. I think they're going to do a massive content drop for this week on Friday. So I do think tomorrow we're going to get some big names. And my first guess is. Is gonna be invincible step <clears throat> sorry invincible steph curry because we haven't got a promo card of curry since i'm not even kidding a promo card because i'm not counting playoffs we haven't got a promo card of curry since literally all the way since season three is that not ridiculous to say curry has not got a promo card since season three and we're now like halfway into season seven pretty much like almost halfway into season seven or like getting there halfway so curry hasn't got a promo card in four seasons that is ridiculous that is absolutely crazy so i do think my first invincible guess is going to be steph curry now they could go absolutely crazy and give us four invincibles i wouldn't be surprised because last week you guys have seen you know i think they ramped it up every single content drop right because generational had the one invincible which was t mac and then in season seven the first one we got was the Unfuego set which had two invincibles magic and Giannis. so that was three total invincibles and then and then in the last set the own said they gave us three invincible cards lamello scotty pippen and shack so maybe they go four this time so i could honestly see four invincibles i'll do four guesses just to be safe but i'll do like my first three is the guys that i think will be if it's going to be three invincibles and then i'll make that last prediction so i, I do think curry is going to be getting an invincible tomorrow no matter what i think that's a pretty solid guess i'd be surprised if he doesn't also because i feel like curry going towards the nba player base is probably the most casual card in the game if you guys want to mean by casual like most there's a lot of curry fans we all know there's tons and tons of curry fans he's one of the biggest names in you know nba he's maybe even the face of the league some people say right so 2k knows a great way to get people into the game mode is dropping a high level curry card that people are going to want to obtain whether they buy packs for whether they spend a lot of mt to get all the type of stuff they know curry is really good for the casual player base because everybody loves steph curry at least a lot of people love curry in 2k so i could definitely see him coming out tomorrow as one of the three or four new invincibles i think we'll also get either lebron or kobe i would be really shocked if we get both i think it could be kobe lebron or jordan and it has to be one of those three names i think those are the three biggest names of all time when it does come to 2k my team kind of related stuff i would say those are probably the top three most hype biggest names you know just in my team history so i think it's got to be one of lebron jordan kobe i could see potentially maybe two of those guys getting put in this content drop but i would be very surprised so my guess is going to be I think I think it's Kobe or LeBron because MJ just recently got a card from the season six set like the hero dark matter he recently got that dark matter the uh, hero one and then also the elemental so I think it's going to be Kobe or LeBron Kobe hasn't got a promo card since the highlight reel which was back in season five he got his dark matter and then LeBron hasn't got a promo dark matter since the all-star set back all the way in season four right at the end of season four so I do think it's going to be LeBron or Kobe as the headlining dark matter there's still going to be potentially one or two more but for the headliner one i'm gonna go oh, it's, uh, i'm gonna go lebron 
I think they'll drop Braun and Co uh, Braun and Curry just because once again they know for today's NBA those are probably the two those are the two biggest names in NBA in the NBA right now. So I think to get the casuals and they want to do the two biggest names. So I think they're gonna go Braun Curry as two invincibles. Now for the other two, I do think we get Larry Bird. For some reason, I think Larry Bird's coming out today. Not really sure why. I will say, okay, so here's my guess. If it's three Invincibles, I'm not guessing Larry Bird. I think it's going to be Curry, LeBron, and then a big man, which I'll talk about here in a second. If we're getting four Invincibles, then I think you throw Larry Bird somewhere in the mix. So he's going to be my last guess. He's going to be my fourth one. So if we do get four Invincibles, I think Larry Bird will be that fourth Invincible. Now to talk about the big, I think it really comes down to and D Rob Kareem right we got Shaq last uh we, we, we got Shaq last Friday he was the one like center power forward card I think we get Kareem or D Rob my initial guess wants to say D Rob just because he came out before Kareem but I could see D Rob I could see Kareem I'm not gonna say Hakeem because he just got a season six level 40 dark matter but I I still I still could somewhat see Hakeem Hakeem Olajuwon getting an invincible but I think it's gonna be a center card it could potentially be Yao I'd be very surprised if it was though, because he just got a card recently, you know, only a couple weeks ago now. So I'd be very surprised if it is Yao, but I think there's gotta be one center power forward card. I think it's either gonna be Cream or D-Rob. And I'd be very surprised if it's not, because I don't think we get a Dwight. I'm trying to think about some other bigs that could drop, you know, four in Invincible. Bill Russell, potentially, right? When's the last time Bill, oh no, Bill Russell has that Dark Matter from season five. I could potentially see Bill Russell, something like that. I think it's gotta be a, you know, all-time great center, whether it's Bill Russell, whether it's Wilt, right? A Bill Russell, a Wilt, a Kareem, a D-Rob. I think it's got to be one of those four names, but I think I'm going to narrow it down between Kareem and D-Rob. And I'm going to guess, I'm going to guess Kareem. I'm going to go Kareem. I think it's going to be Curry, LeBron, and Kareem as the three Invincibles. If there's going to be three Invincibles, and then if there's a fourth one, I do think it will be Larry Bird. But like I said, guys, let me know in the comment section down below your guys' your guys's Invincible guesses whether there's three or four invincibles dropping and then now quickly just to go over the dark matters there's going to be five new dark matters in the promo set these ones are pretty much damn near impossible to actually guess just because there's so many dark matters in a set now that they could really give out any single names they did give us a lot of current dark matters with dame you know pascal siakam jalen brown so i don't think there'll be that many you know um current players getting a dark matter I don't really have any guesses like if you go back to like season three you know you can kind of guess some cards in here like maybe a i still think Serge Ibaka could get a galaxy opal or dark matter but yeah i'm not really sure my galaxy opal or my galaxy opal my dark matter guesses i think it's really hard to do like maybe you know terrence ross gets an opal or a dark matter maybe jeremy shohan gets an opal like was there any rookies in the last content drop I don't believe there was. Yeah, there was no rookies. It was weird. Like, all the Galaxy Opals were, like, older players. And then, like, most of the Dark Matters were current players. So, maybe they do, like, a flip. And maybe a lot of the Opals are current players. Like, you know, Terrence Ross. Maybe Serge Ibaka. You know, those type of cards. A Jeremy Shohan as a rookie. Something like that. I'm really not too sure about the Dark Matter guesses. But, like I said, guys, my four Invincible guesses are going to be Curry, LeBron, Cream, and Larry Bird. And if it's three Invincibles, I think it's going to be Curry, LeBron, and Cream. But let me know in the comment section down below what Invincible invincibles you guys think we'll be getting tomorrow and let me know also what dark matters what galaxy so just any guesses about tomorrow's content and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace